hello guys welcome to today's video by trust stanley and this is a ts tech talk video so on today's video i'm going to show you guys how to enable stats for youtube now this stats actually allows you to check information of the video you are watching and also the information of your current device right now um let's dive into that so i'll explain more so um first to enable the stats on youtube all you need to do is to click on your profile icon on the top right hand area and then click on the settings section that gear icon and now click on general and scroll down a little bit to the bottom you are going to notice where it says enable start for net now click on that to enable it and when you enable it i'm also going to show you guys how to make use of start for net now click on any video just about any video you're watching on youtube I'm going to allow you to it's the biggest sales event of the year all right guys so i have to pause the video so that i will show you guys the information so first the um the first thing i'm going to do to explain this video i'm going to actually click on the video player and you notice this get icon next to the cc click on the get icon is actually called the settings so when you click that it's going to bring in some more information and you notice right now you can see stats for nets but um if you're watching video without enabling it you will not be able to see stats for nets for right now we can see it but before we do that actually guys pay attention to your video quality currently the video quality is set to auto and this actually changes depending on how fast your internet is so um currently we are using 360 pixel right now if you click on start to net you are going to see the information of the video and you can notice the first one is your device name which is the device we're currently watching the video on and then the next one is a cpn and it gives more information also and then the other one is actually the video id which is the id of the current video that we're watching right now and then the other one is also the video format which is also um an encoded format of the video we're watching and you can notice right now the video is currently on 640 by 360 and it's under um three pixel per second so now um 30 frame rate i mean so actually if you pay attention to the previous one i showed you guys it was also on 360 pixel so this is very accurate to what you are watching with and now you can pay attention and notice the audio format that we're currently using which is 251 ops so um depending on the video that was created is going to come up with those information like that and if you look below you are going to see the volume of the video we are currently using and it says um 46 and if you notice right now my video is currently um my volume is currently under 46 also so if you pay attention to the below section it shows you the bandwidth of the video you are currently watching and it's also showing the um, redhead of the video you are currently watching. So those two are actually the network um, signal and the network information. And then the viewport is actually the size of your screen that you're currently using right now. Now to actually confirm this, I'm going to show you guys even more things. Now let me close this out. Click on the get icon once more. Click on quality and click on advanced. I'm going to change the quality of this video to 720 pixel. So I click on the menu also once um, once more, click on the start to net, and it did not update. The reason why it did not update is because the video had not played after I changed it. So let me go ahead and play the video. It's actually going to load up and refresh. So let me play. All right, so guys, let's go ahead and check if the, the information actually corresponds. So let me click on start for next once more. And you can notice right now that it's changed to 720. And guys, quick information. When you make these changes on the quality area, it might not reflect immediately right here. But just pay close attention. After a while, you can notice that it is placed. And then you can also notice our viewpoint currently is on 10, 1080 by 608. So let me go ahead and change this to full screen mode let me click on the bottom now it's currently on full screen mode hold on i have to close that off so that we'll be able to see it properly so click on start for next and you can notice right now we are watching on 1920 by 1080 pixel so that is currently how it works that is how your start for nets work i do not know if this is important for you but this is actually how to check the start and be more accurate with the information but um this is actually not for everybody but for some reason if this is for you then it's awesome and also there is even more more thing you can do after checking this start for nets you can click on copy debugging and then paste it to your email and forward it to whoever you want to forward it to which is probably if the video information is actually 
actually needed so that is all i want to show you guys on today's video and if it's helpful do not forget to smash like and subscribe to the channel for more video i'll be seeing you guys on my next video please stay safe and peace